On Tuesday, January 10th, the Millard West Wildcats took on the nationally ranked Bellevue West Thunderbirds in their 11th game of the year. Millard West came into the game at 3-7, following a tough loss to Papio South, while Bellevue West, led by standout senior guard and Creighton Blue Jay commit Josiah Dotzler, remained undefeated at 12-0 and winning the Omaha Metro Holiday Tournament. Things started rough for the Wildcats as the Thunderbirds went on a quick 19-0 run, and with Millard West only being able to add one point off a of Zach Grandinat free throw, they would end the first quarter down 21-1. Uh, we had to catch up to their speed early. Obviously, we got down big early because of their full court pressure. Um, so we just had to try to slow down a little bit and not turn the ball over. Well, we limited turnovers, so we had the ball more. Um, and then, and then we, we didn't set as many ball screens, so they couldn't double team us. I'd say let it all out. We got nothing to lose. They're number 23 in the nation. I'm like, just go out and play. However, Millard West had a very impressive second quarter, putting up 20 points with big threes coming from senior guard Cole Kirshner and junior guard Jordan Gasson. The Wildcats were down 45-21 to to end the second quarter, but only four points separated the two and points scored in that second period of play. Honestly, just take care of the ball and knock down shots when we need, when we need big buckets. What I've been telling the younger guys is to stick with it and continue to buy into what coaches have been saying because... It won't work to be good, and we can't be good if they simply aren't on the same page. Things would slow down for both teams entering the second half, as Millard West allowed just 11 points and tacking on eight of their own, and in the fourth would be outscored by just one point, 13-14. to 14. The slow start made it near impossible for David to take down Goliath as Millard West fell 70-42. to 42. Uh, We're going to try to bounce back by staying positive. We know we're right there with those good teams, and we got a tough schedule, but hopefully we can win some of these games coming up. Uh, I've noticed from the team this year that there's a lot of fight and grit, and we uh, battle till the end of the games. Millard West falls to 3-8 and eight on the season, but have a chance to tack on some wins late in the year as they face Lincoln Southwest, Bellevue East, and Millard South all over the course of the next week. For the MWHS Wildcat News, this has been Logan Mosley and Nathan Delaney.